And what's up you guys? It's your boy SF Bay Area Sports Talk and the Green Bay Packers have signed former Panthers wide receiver Devin Funchess. Now if you're a Green Bay Packers fan, I think this is a great signing for you guys. As we know, a season ago, the Packers only had one wide receiver that eclipsed 500 or more receiving yards, and that was, of course, Devontae Adams, who had a spectacular season in which he had 83 catches for 997 yards to go with five touchdowns. So bringing in a guy like Funches, he is going to immediately become the second option at wide receiver on this group. And the thing that I like about Funches a lot, he's a big body receiver. He comes in at 6'4", 225 pounds. So I think he is going to be a great target for Aaron Rodgers. And if we look at his best season, season was 2017 as he had 63 catches for 840 yards to go with eight touchdowns. Now, last season, 2019, it didn't go so well for Funches as he ended up breaking his collarbone on the first game of the season, and that ended up sidelining him the entire rest of the season. So, of course, the Packers are taking a chance on Funches in this case, and they are hopeful, hopeful he can stay healthy and have a productive 2020 season. Now, the Packers are still looking for a deep thread wide receiver, one that is capable of stretching the field and opening it up for Aaron Rodgers. And the good thing about this year's upcoming NFL draft, there is a ton of talent at wide receiver, so the Packers could get the guy they want, a speedy guy. And I mean, that's going to be huge to add to this group. And now in other related news for the Packers, they also went out this offseason and addressed some changes they needed to make at the linebacker position. As we know, they lost BJ Goodson in free agency. And so they went out and signed Christian Kirksey, who is a great linebacker. And I think he is going to be a fabulous addition. And he is going to be paired alongside defensive lineman star Kenny Clark. So this defense has definitely gotten better. And, you know, the secondary, I mean, the Packers secondary got lit up last year. Another issue they had a lot at times was their run defense. And it was evident in the NFC Championship game against my Niners as we just ran completely rampant on that Packers defense. So it will be important for the Packers to try to add some top talent at defensive line in this upcoming draft to try to improve the Packers defense so that they can stop the run. Now, also in other related news, this offseason, the Packers also had a need at right tackle. They wanted to try to improve there, so they went out and signed Rick Wagner. So I think that it will be a good signing for the Packers. And yeah, things are starting to look good for them now with the signings they've made. And I think it's going to be a lot better offense, potentially, than what we saw last season. And, you know, Aaron Rodgers is such a great quarterback that you put some good pieces around him and, you know, you're going to have a really great football team. So it should be a lot of fun to watch this upcoming And so, season. guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you made it all the way through to the end of this video, then be sure to smash up that thumbs up button and smash that subscriber button and smash that bell button if you have not done so already. If you would like to be notified when brand new NFL breaking news will be coming to you guys live with all the latest happenings in the NFL. So let me know down in that comment section, Green Bay Packers fans. I would love to get your guys' thoughts and perspective on the free agent signing of Devin Funchess. Let me know if you're excited about this move and what are your thoughts upcoming for the season. And as always, you guys, until next time, I will see you again. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.